Hi everyone, thank you for stopping by and I hope I can help you with a very quick tutorial on how to share Canva templates on Etsy for free. Yes, you heard it right, for free, which means you do not have to get Canva Pro. Okay, so first things first, I'm going to go to Canva. Now I've got everything that I need ready just to make this tutorial a quick one for you, okay? If you don't have Canva, you need to create one. You can use a um, Google account or you can just sign up, right? So assuming that you do have a Canva um, account, you're going to want to sign into Canva and go on the home page. From here, <clears throat> excuse me, from here you're going to want to go to create a design. And depending on the design that you want and the size that you want, you can go to custom size where you can input the sizes you want. And in my case, I want an A4 document, which I've already created. So I'm going to quickly press that and show you as it will be basically a blank template. So from here, I'll make my design which is already um, created, which is this. So now that you have your design, what you want to do is you want to share. You want to go to the share button. And then from here, you want to find template link. Okay, so click on template link and it will come up with a disclaimer for you, basically saying that Anyone with this link can use this design as a template and the person that get, has the link must have an account with Canva and it also uh, disclaims that you won't know who has made copies of the design, okay? So you have to basically be okay with that. If you're not, then don't use Canva. <laughs> so back to the story, you want to get this link, so copy link, right? And then from here, what you want to do is you want to go back to home. You want to create a new design. And let's say, for example, you want A A4. Um, again, over here, what you'd want to do is like, I don't know, say something like, hey, thank you for purchasing. Um, this is the link. So I've already created that. Let me just show you. Okay, so I just wrote, hey there, please read below, blah, 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 click me. So this is where I plan to put my link. So it will basically be a hyperlink. Um, and then thank you, said studio. So from here, I want to add, I want to double click on click me. And then I want to go and find this paperclip looking icon which is to link the design that I created um, and make hyperlink. So I'll, I'll, press, sorry, I'll press on link and then I will um, command V or, you know, right click paste and then basically done. Once it's done, you'll see that the, um, the click me now has a, um, has been underlined which means that it's a now an active link from here what i want to do is go to share and then i want to download and i want to download it as a pdf standard right so then it will open up and then from here what you'd want to do is just double check that it does work and it does link to the page that you want it to. So I'll click this. Now, this is basically what I will get as a customer. So it basically says that, you know, Z Studio was shared with you um, to start this designing now. So if I don't have a Canva account as a customer, I will need to create one. If I do, I could use template immediately. And here I have it. I've opened it up and this is me using a different Google account. 
um, and from here I can make edits. So I can, oh, I can, for example, get rid of this. I can duplicate this. Let me group this. I can, basically I can make any edits that I want. Let's say as the customer, I'm now happy with this. I can then either go to text and then like add a text box and create a digital um, to-do list. Or if I want to print this out, I can then go to share. I can then go to download and then download it in the, um, in the format that I want. And so there you have it. I hope it's been helpful. Please leave a comment and thank you.